I feel like Vitafly gonna recap this and say God he caught a 30 on the dime roll. So all y'all wanna know what happened, I'm gonna tell you what happened. He got smoked. That one was crazy out of the game. Sometimes that's Peter, nobody that knows body. Hit his area with 51. Everything in the Vitafly. We used to rapping like that. Shot nearly lost some we've been in them trenches playing off and stash box every shark and won't forget about drinking about that faucet how we 20 doing 20 make me nauseous heart froze he almost died before we been sliding more and trying to find him more every skeleton in my closet was alive before i'm trying to tie sound what's popping with the population you already know what it is man salute to the subscribers that notification gang RiceGangClothing.com for the merchandise you heard me right got my brother with me showtime sp to nobody that knows bodies Chit, 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 chit. So uh, we in the building, you know, um, back, back, back to talk about a couple things. Mm -hmm. But we should start with none other than Born Legacy. Yeah. Born Legacy X. Mm. Born Legacy X. Mm -hmm. It's X everything. X you had everything. Gnome yeah. X, you had Summer, Summer Madness Some X. Madness. Now we got Born Legacy X. So you got Born Legacy is a series mm -hmm. that we all know. A lot of legends. Or a lot of superstars, a lot of big time names was created in the Born Legacies. Mm -hmm. Born Legacy is where Ad vs. Rum Nitty happened. Oof. Tay Rock vs. JC happened. Mm -hmm. You know, Charlie Clips battles who surf on there. It's a certain December fourth. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. December fourteenth is what? It's what the fuck happened in Sue Day? Oh, okay, you funny. know, a lot of a lot of legendary joints. Mm. You know, um, Young Ill battled on Born Legacy. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Um, and they, Popeyes, Why I Order. Mm -hmm. Born Legacy. Mm -hmm. Was Smack? Who is this nigga on a Born Legacy? No, that wasn't Born Legacy. No, that wasn't. But it was before. Legacy. But you understand? I, I you, get you. I see get where, you. you see where I'm getting at, mm -hmm. right? So you have a platform where MCs are being kind of introduced to the main stage, like being introduced to the main audience of people. Mm. Born Legacy is a battle you take. Born Legacy could make or break people. For real. I've seen people battle on Born Legacy and go to the highest heights, mm -hmm. and I've seen people battle on Born Legacy and we never seen them again. Never seen them again. So, <laughs> it's kind of like, you know, this is, the, this is your make or break for a lot of these cats. Yeah. Um, for the top tiers, I want to say at least mid to top tiers is, is definitely for that because you got to look at you got to look at how the Survivor Series is more of the PGs. This is your, this is your last stretch. Born Legacy, no, nah, we need you. We we need to make sure that you're here to stay. But this one is a little bit more special because I believe a lot of these guys that are on the card has either had a Born Legacy or. Mm -hmm. Or was on was was supposed to be on Born Legacy. Well, this Born Legacy is looking a lot like just the rookies versus vets. Mm -hmm. um, you know, it's just a lot of. Let's run through the battles. You got mm -hmm. DNA versus Luke Castro, mm -hmm. uh, Real Sick versus B Magic, mm -hmm. Kid Chaos versus Danger Zone, mm -hmm. Shotgun Shug versus Brooklyn Hands, Gems versus Your Honor, mm -hmm. Riggs versus JC. And none other than my dog, Av versus Fonz. That's like the Spider-Man meme. Mm -hmm. You, 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 you. Uh, I'm a like. I'm gonna just be honest with you. In order to keep it a buck, I gotta be honest. Mm -hmm. I'm not gonna make any friends with this one. Mm -hmm. I'm, they, I, people probably gonna be mad, and I don't really give a fuck. Because I'm going to call it like a caller so I can't spoil it. And I know that you don't have no problem doing the same <laughs> thing. No, I'm so I'm going to start with none other than Jim's versus Your Honor. I want to start right there. Okay. I don't know who Your Honor knows. Mm -hmm. I don't know who Your Honor is related to. Mm -hmm. But I'm starting to question how the hell is he getting these looks? Because the last couple times I done seen him take me to church. Uh, mm -hmm. He been getting he been getting beat like Battle with Ill Will, I understand he lost a relative like Dale's two before, but he got smoked regardless. He third round, he's doing like a speech, he's getting his ass whooped. 
I, I haven't even, the only thing, the only moment that I remember from him is my clothes look better, my shoes look better, my house look better, my cars look better. Mm -hmm. Other than that, I don't remember nothing from him. I'm not hating either. You done? I'm done. Because you're not hating. I'm done. But allow me. Your honor has to have the same, he must be on the same boat as your drugs, yeah, 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 uh, 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 cause they just keep giving them bags. You understand what I'm saying? They just keep putting them on, and they keep putting them on a platter to get smoked. He battled Swamp, smoked. Uh, he battled, uh, 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 come on, um, come on, who did he battle right after that? It don't even matter. Clockdown. Um, <laughs> Pat Project Pat. Pro Pro uh, Pat Pat. Gunpowder Pat. Whatever yeah, the fuck his name is. See, and, I told you I'm not making friends he, here. Listen. Gunpowder He Pat. did the tournament. Smoked. First of all, we don't even know how he got to the second round. Never mind. I don't know. But when he battled Ill Will, sir, sir, you know, there's, there's legendary third rounds. You yes. know what I'm saying? It's usually the talk to me third rounds. You know yes. what I'm saying? Yes. Um, My man gave... Uh, album outro. Yo, I just want to thank y'all for coming out. Mm -hmm. You know, like I shout out to my man Scoops over there. You know what I'm saying, he gave us the blueprint outro. He said, yo, no, he gave us the uh, the black album outro. Yo, you remember that time, home? You know, we was outside and the dog yeah. beat on homie. Yeah, like, yeah, nigga, yeah. we don't care about none of this right now. What do you, you know, what I'm saying, you know, now, granted, you know, rest in peace to your brother and all of that. But I, I can't jack it. You still had time before. All of that. I'm just saying, you had to, you had time before all of that to have a third round. You could have chopped it up. But needless to say, all I've got to say is, you know, Dwayne Wade has thrown up a few good ones. Steve Nash has thrown up a few good ones. John Stockton is known to do it. Gary Payton is also known to do it. I know where you're going. With you know this. I'm going. To, you know what I'm your saying? Your just alley. Your just. Listen, Jim's all I need you to do is a nice little windmill, just make it look nasty. <laughs> I'm be honest with you. you your honor, um, I'm gonna be honest with you. Salute to Jim's. That's my guy. You know what I'm saying? Like I speak, hey. we speak on a lot of different levels as far as like life, battles, battle rap. I didn't even know he was gonna be coming back this soon, working out things like mm -hmm. that. And um, he's made a lot of changes for himself, and he's he's literally turned his whole life around. Mm. You know, he's done a lot of positive things. He's became a father. You know, he's been building his channel. He's Absolutely. been doing. But fuck all that mm. positive shit. Can you rap? Glock nine. Can you rap? Listen, we ain't seen you battle in a very long time. Mm -hmm. I will say this, Jims. You cannot lose. You cannot lose to your honor. Somebody who's been losing, damn, like losing battle for battle for battle for battle for battle. You need to be in whatever bag that it is that's going to make you relevant. Because as a blogger, mm -hmm. salute to Jims, wonderful blogger, right? Stop being dirty. Wonderful blogger. The difference between a lot of other bloggers and you. Is you have to still go out there and play. Mm. We don't ever have to battle. No. Nope. So you going out there to play, and you talk about the battles. You talk about battles not being good. You mm -hmm. talk about winners. You talk about losers. Mm -hmm. They're gonna cook you okay. if you don't do good in your battles. You know what I'm saying? Um, I'm be honest with you in this battle. I got gems two one man. Yeah. I, I just can't see. I'm, I, I, I'm like I, I can't. It's hard for me. I, I don't even know how could I see anything but Jim's winning because your honor don't win battles. Like he just don't. He does not win battles. I'm gonna give you the rounds that Jim's wins. Okay, you ready? You ready, guys? Yeah. Spoiler alert: Round one and round three. Round one. Welcome back, Jim's. Mm -hmm. Once you got the stuff that's in the bag. Oh, you're still funny. Oh, you still got the bars. Oh, mm -hmm. it's the amazement that's gonna be there. Third round. All you have to do is fucking rap. Yeah. Uh, I, got him, I got him winning. Yeah, two one. Um, next battle. Let's go. Danger Zone versus Kid Chaos. Kid okay, Chaos so, God damn, can we talk about the battle no. first? God damn, listen. So he's got Kid Chaos two one, and I'm cool with that. But here's the deal. Um, Kid Chaos has he's got to do he's got to do better for me. Yeah. Only reason why is because the first battles that I seen, mm -hmm. like the shit that we recapped mm -hmm. when he battled the one nigga when he first came on. He was crazy and the, uh, the fucking the fucking breeze on the pump. Got some, tell me what you want and all that other shit. Like that shit was super crazy. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. you, I don't want your best performance that I've seen so far to be like the first time I saw you. It's got to be elevation to create separation. You mm -hmm. can't be you go here and then your next performance is here. Then your next performance is the same level. Then the next one's like I need you to be going this way. 
And Danger Zone is an MC who he can rap. He's a comparable opponent. But the thing is, Danger Zone's pen and the level of respect for Danger Zone has went from here to like down here somewhere. Like, M like he's not a highly respected MC. Mm -hmm. I don't fucking know why. Like I said in this blog, I ain't making no friends. I'm gonna call it straight like it is. But you don't get a lot of respect no more. This is true. You I remember there was a time when people battled Danger Zone. He was looked at as one of the most dangerous MCs. He was dangerous. Pen, but people, it's like. It's like the common cold. He went from coronavirus mm -hmm. to the common cold. Like, mm -hmm. it's like, okay, you sick, but you ain't sick, sick, sick. You see what I'm saying? So, I think that in this battle, while Danger Zone has been in many positions and had a lot of different battles that he could that he could win, mm -hmm. you know what I mean? I just feel like in this one, it's set up. This battle is booked for Kid Chaos to show us what he can do. Mm -hmm. I feel like he needs to bring some shit, though. Like, yeah. Oh, yeah. Because... Right now, out of these rookie guys, you got real sick and easy to block him. Mm -hmm. Right? They 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 one and one. And then there's a drop. And then there's other guys. You know mm -hmm. what I'm saying? That you can pull that you can pick and choose. But the two shining ones is real sick and easy to block him. And yeah. we'll get into them a little later. Yeah. But this is a chance for Kid Chaos to kind of supplant that. He's gotta you gotta elevate in this one. Mm -hmm. What you got to say? Kid Chaos to one. So that's it. That's, that's it. That's it. Uh, no, you, you, I mean, you I explained I mean, everything. You went over. You you did a lot. I went over my to time. explain that Danger Zone is still at where he's at. Yeah, from five and for years King, ago. From yeah, like no, not five years ago. We're Danger Zone is in JC's class. No, I'm saying from the like, he's been in from from taking five years ago mm -hmm. till now he's the same level. Like, Danger he's Zone. Been, is in JC's class. I understand that, but I'm just saying in the last five years, he has not done anything significant. And this is a narrative. I don't give a fuck. Fuck you. Oh, but this, <laughs> this, I'm just saying I'm he hasn't you. done anything. I'm you know saying, what I'm saying? So like, he hasn't done anything. When Danger Zone was cooking, okay. everybody in his class surpassed him. Okay. The only time Danger Zone really was cooking, cooking, cooking mm -hmm. was when he was on Black Ice. He ain't on Black Ice. This is URL. He did good versus Chef Trez, though. Who won that battle? I don't know. I don't Chef Tress won that battle. Okay. I'm, I'm, I'm saying Danger Zone's pen is good. It's good. But for some reason, it's the it factor. He does not have that it factor. Okay. And it's just been like that. He, he, he can have the baby verb dreads all he wants to. It's fine. Just don't mess up the rest of the event. Okay. And I still got Kid Chaos 2 on. Let's go. Kid Chaos uh, got a lot to prove. And, and, Riggs and, versus JC. What's up? You making this easy for me, JC? Um, two one. Now I'm not gonna say, oh, I'm sleeping on Riggs. Riggs' last performance when he was out there on the basketball court, it was good. It was a good battle. I see it. But it was, you know, it was more like it. Kind of, there was other battles out there, so the gas was a little bit more passed around. I'm just saying, um, JC. It's hard for JC to lose battles. And when he does, it's debatably lost. I already lost the prep. Really clear, too. I ain't That's see what it. I heard. I ain't see I, it. I heard, I heard. Can't but see I don't, it. I mean, I, 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 this is what I heard. Mm -hmm. I, so we'll see when it comes out. Right. Um, I got JC21. Yep. There's nothing else for me to say about this. It is what it is. I mean, whatever. Go ahead. Uh, hopefully, it turns out to be a good one. But um, t -t 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 moving on. Shotgun Suge versus Brooklyn Hands. Mm -hmm. See, the thing about this, right? Mm -hmm. Shotgun Suge. Be, be, did a lot of MCs that I don't be understand, they be doing this, you know, they want to battle bigger names, they want the verbs, they want the looks, they want the bigger cards. When you're battling against a none none one event, then the next event, Brooklyn Hands, then the next event, Rookie Cookie, like that's the level you're going to stay on, you mm -hmm. see what I'm saying? Like mm -hmm. when they, when they, you know, y'all niggas know, like especially with the niggas that, with the hoes and the females and shit, when you got somebody on a certain level and you could treat them like that, you ain't got the roof, Chrisom. You could Chipotle Olive, him. Olive Garden him. Olive Garden is top tier. That's top tier. That's, all right, my I'm talking about Chipotle him, Chudobo him, mm -hmm. Chick fil A him, mm -hmm. mm -hmm. you know, Chinese food him. You, know, they like the you ain't got to they do like, nothing. Like the you, this is it. <laughs> That's how they're treating some of these MCs. If you keep taking all these bottom tier battles, why the fuck am I booking you versus Verb? Why the fuck am I booking you versus these top tier MCs? They're not even looking for that. I feel like he should be Brooklyn Hands, but I just watched him battle none none and I felt like none none won that shit. You see what I'm saying? So it's like definitely put up a fight. He put uh, he, he he was swinging. Mm -hmm. Uh, it, it, see, when it comes to these battles, like these joints right here, they be like two minute rounds or some shit like that, mm -hmm. and they don't stop nobody. So the rookie is trying to make their name, so they gonna write three four minutes. Mm -hmm. 
you're gonna spend two minutes so it's gonna look like your round is short. Yep. But the rookie, like, well, like, well, none, of, none of those rounds was long as hell. Yeah. And nobody stopped them. Of course not. You know what I'm saying? It's a so shot. Who you got winning, man? Shotgun shoot two one. Shotgun shoot two one. You doing a lot. You doing a lot. Yeah, you doing a lot of this narrative. I, it, is, <laughs> it is what it is. You know they gonna hate me anyway, so Facts. it don't matter. Um, All I'm saying is, and and it's, and it's no shot towards Brooklyn Hands to me. I don't think Brooklyn is. Hands had. It. I don't think Brooklyn Hands has whatever whatever it is that the OGs are hearing and a lot of these like the the legendary battle rappers they were like man Brooklyn hands he be saying some stuff I I don't be hearing it I I don't I don't so for him to battle Suge Suge is chasing pins so obviously Suge's pin is way farther than Brooklyn hands right now so are we going with the whole bully effect or are we going with that big guy versus big guy it's opportunity versus opportunity it's Cause, opportunity because Suge don't be caring about these battles I'm telling you he, he don't, don't be caring about these battles man it's gonna be it's gonna be it's gonna be standard material you know what I'm saying like the 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 hand no the hand, 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 mm -hmm. hand clap mm -hmm. the man's act the jam pack Get slipping in Miami. Where's stamp at? Like mm -hmm. that's gonna be it's gonna be simple bars. That, like it don't be it don't be about nothing. Mm -hmm. You see what I'm saying? I feel you. So I don't see an elevation process in that for him. Uh, he might. I don't know. I, I just know how I feel. Anyway, it, it's, my, it's, one. it's just my thoughts. Go ahead. Um, Let's get into some to, to some debates now. Now you got real sick versus B Magic. Uh, three Ooh. years ago. This would have been super crazy, mm -hmm. and I would have clearly had B Magic winning. The B Magic that I know of nowadays, I just don't know if he's gonna be able to keep up with the amount of pen that Real Six. Real Six pen is fucking crazy. To me, he's got the best pen out of this class. His flows is crazy. He he's able to do. He just stood up there with Chilla, and didn't die. Yeah. Regardless of this, people who feel like he won that battle. There's I, a lot of folks who feel like he won that battle, and I got no issues the with third. that. He stood up there with Chilla Jones and danced a Chilla Jones that was not playing. He still smoking shit. Yes. Chilla still smoking shit though. Uh, I got I got real sick winning two one if not three zero. Oh. You call how you want. Ah, uh, this is another lesson that needs to be taught, mm -hmm. and I think B Magic is all about teaching that lesson. Mm -hmm. Is your pen is nice, mm -hmm. but my pen is crazy. Mm -hmm. I'm sorry. I watched a few B Magic battles before I came here. Like I said, I see the glimpses of Magic. Like his yeah, last yeah. few battles, he ain't been choking. Mm -hmm. So like you hearing what he's saying. I love the way that Magic raps because it's he's dancing around a lot of the bars, and it's also gonna be a punchline at the end, probably every single line. Right. Thing about Sick is that Real Sick has a structure, so he builds that house really, really good. Not to mention he's really good at angles at this point right now. So I can honestly see this battle being debatable. I'm saying it's, it may not go the way that everybody think it is. If I think that Magic is going to actually be the same level that he's been lately, right? It's not going to go the way that a lot of people think. I'm still going to go with Real Sick Two One, but I just want to put an asterisk next to it and be like debate. I got a. Uh... Real sick two one, pretty clear too because mm -hmm. now it's it's about hunger, effort, mm -hmm. and that want that that digging down wanting. You have somebody who was already a star, who was already a, B Magic went to the top of the mountain already, quick too. Mm -hmm. Battle conceded, mm -hmm. battle Charlie Clip. He battled people that people's not gonna. You know how many people can say they Nobody battle Charlie Clip? I mean battle conceded already. You know what I'm saying? Like he went to the top. So the what? What your future is my past. I've been here before, like Jay Z said. You mm -hmm. know what I'm saying? That your future, whatever you can uh, hope to uh, achieve, I've done it. I did it. Whether you like it or not, mm -hmm. I did it. You know what I mean? And I just see somebody with the hunger that Real Sick has. It's just like ah. It's I uncanny. I'm uh, just saying it, it, that one might be one of them ones. I'm just I, I, I can't. I, I can't see it. Um, Luke Castro versus DNA. Mm. What's up? Mr. Wildstrong mm -hmm. versus Mr. Get Him the Fuck Out of Here, mm -hmm. aka the PG Killer. Mm -hmm. DNA just came off of uh, 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 his last battle was Verb, and then it was Vixen. Mm -hmm. um, two different styles in that building. A lot of people had DNA win. Then once we saw it on cam and read it back, a lot of people got Verb winning. You know what I'm saying? With Vixen, it was the same both ways. Like, right. Vixen won in the building, Vixen won on the tape. Y'all can see it. It, it. it happened. Now, the thing about DNA is, it, it, it's all of that talk, uh, all that champ talk, 
worth all of that, you know what I'm saying, for you to just be going up against somebody who may have the possibility to try to kill you. I still think that I on this one, I'm going to go with the vet on this one. I'm going to go with DNA on this one. DNA versus a PG never really goes the way that, well, it, it, yeah, it doesn't go the way that people think it will. I just got the PG kill on that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, and he is good. He thinks I hate him. I really don't care. But uh, DNA does got skills. He's able to, you know, break down PGs. Mr. Curry. Uh, you know, he's <laughs> able to, to, to really get wild. He's got a lot of different flows. But give me Lou Castro, whatever. Hey, I'm taking I'm, Lou Castro. Give me Lou Castro. I disagree with one. it. Uh, I've seen him since the beginning, since his inception. He's been waiting for an opportunity. Back to what I said about the last battle. Mm -hmm. It's about hunger. It's about wanting to make a statement. In this battle, he don't even have to beat DNA. He has to survive. Yes. A la Chilla Jones mm -hmm. and Real Sick. Mm -hmm. You have Lou Castro. You know you just have to survive. survive. Right? That survival is the key here. That not getting embarrassed, not getting smoked, not saying what the fuck, not having that happen mm -hmm. is the key to this. You just have to survive. Yeah. And then with that being said, I think Luke Castro is going to have a phenomenal one of his rounds is probably going to be really crazy. And then they go down to the third. We'll see where it goes. I'm going with a uh, big Luke. Luke. Hey. Um, Av versus Fonz. Um, don't just jump out there and be like, I got this person 3-0. No, I want to say something real quick. Oh, right? go ahead. Um, Fonz is a dope MC. Yes. A lot of different punches, a lot of dope energy. He's body bagged a couple people. I really got hip to him, hip to him. I seen him in a, a lot of battles, you know what I'm saying? I seen him from when he first started with his PGs and shit like that. Mm -hmm. I seen him when he body bagged J400. Uh, and I seen him like really, really get busy with folks. A lot of punches uh, came into the tournament. A lot of people didn't have him. I, I. I was one that said from the beginning of the tournament that Fonz could be a sleeper. Sleeper, I picked him to win a couple of battles, he mm -hmm. went on to win the whole damn thing. Mm -hmm. um, we have to see him in a little minute after that though. Where is Fonz? Where is Fonz? Mm -hmm. uh, to get Av, another person who we have not seen in a while. Um, Av gets busy. Av gets busy, Jesus Christ. Um, Av made his name on Born Legacy. Um, I'll let you speak about it. What's up? The odds are stacked against Fonz. Oh, yeah. Um, who needs to win? For real, for real? This battle needs to be just as big as Av and Nitty. Just as big as it Will and Rum. Just, it needs to be. The reason why I'm saying that is because both sides uh -huh. have a lot to prove. You want Fonz won that whole tournament. That whole tournament, nobody say the whole tournament ain't nobody say nothing to Fonz. Fonz ain't get no place before that. Uh -huh. Only person he kept saying is we want Av. He gotta get Av. He gotta get Av. Why? Cause he sound like Av. Uh -huh. Are we sure about that? Thing about Av is Av when when Av stopped battling for a time, it's cause he was sick. Right, right, right. Like after he got after he felt better. He just was in the gym. You right. mean to tell me a man who almost was inches from losing his life, now he got the opportunity to do what he loves to do? Mm -hmm. You mean to tell me Av ain't gonna come back in here smoking something? This, both of these are the 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 the, uh, the underdog story because both of them are the underdog. The worst mm -hmm. part about it is nobody can really pick a winner because everybody's favorite is each one. You know what I'm saying? When you wanted Fonz to do better, we was figuring out where Fonz was, everybody was in Fonz's corner. When Av got sick, he was like, yo, what's going on with Av? He even let, when, once he left the K, yo, what's really going on with Av? Same thing, personally wise, you want Av to win, come back and smoke some. This battle has no other choice but to be debatable. Mm. It has no other choice. But if I had to go with the gun in my head, of course I gotta go with the, the I gotta go with Mr. Miyagi over Daniel son. I'm gonna go with Av. I don't gotta be in debatable, I gotta have winning. Um, <laughs> Clearly, I got Ab winning. The reason why I got Ab winning, and I don't pick against Fonz often, is just mm -hmm. everything that I've seen Fonz do, I've seen Ab do. Ab done it, yeah. I've seen Ab do better. Yeah. I mean, it is what it is. Mm -hmm. I've seen Ab. I've seen Ab beat a really good chess. When chess <sighs> back when chess was chess, when not chess, the chess yeah. that we've seen like the last couple weeks. I'm talking about in the last couple of months. I'm talking about I seen Av be a really good chess. Av has I seen Av battle shotgun sugar on Summer Madness. You know what I'm saying? I've seen Av 
beat some real. I've seen Av beat JC, who was in his fucking bag. I seen Av go all the way to the West Coast and battle Gichi Gotti before Gichi Gotti was even Gichi Gotti. So I can't pick against that. You know what I'm saying? And I also want to say it was Av who made B Magic choke. All it, over the place. It was Av who made Mav choke. It Av ain't no like no. Av has. Not only does Av has skeletons in his closet, it stinks. Yeah. He moved. They're still there. Like. He just, the only thing he doing is he just taking the cobwebs off the door and kicking the door open. Welcome back, Av. Welcome back, Fonz. You, you done woke up a bear. No pun intended to T-Top. But you done woke, and I seen Av the The bodies that Fonz is looking for, Av has already buried them in, in, in his closet. So, ugh. For, like I said, I really, I really want to go for the underdog, but I gotta go with Dan. I gotta go with Mr. Miyagi on this one. Mm. Mm. It's gonna be a goodie. Has no choice but to be debatable. Yeah, the roof true. has to be going at the end of that night. Should be good. Mm -hmm. um, but I will say this, you know, um, up and down the card. I hope. I really hope the MCs do their thing. You mm -hmm. know what I'm saying? I really do. I know those MCs who feel like, oh, we don't like them, and all. It's like I don't know you niggas to not like you. I just call it how I call it, <laughs> so I don't spoil it. You know what I'm saying? Like, what, if my truth or your truth offends somebody, you mm -hmm. know what I'm saying, or makes somebody feel a type of way. Mm -hmm. Really don't give a fuck because it is what it is. How I feel. Yes, it's, it's my personal. It's our personal opinion. But uh, you know, I definitely uh, like the battles that have been put together. I would definitely watch them. And if if we get a prediction or so wrong, you know, we'll go back and we'll go over it. Of course. And um, we'll be right here to be like, yo, I said that this person was going to win, and this person yeah. did not win. What are you doing? But you know, as you do, man, we appreciate y'all everything. You know what I'm saying? We back though. And we go. Drinking about that faucet, how he 20 doing 20 make me nauseous. Heart froze, he almost died before we been sliding more and trying to find him more. Every skeleton in my closet was alive before I'm traumatized. I don't regret it, we 